All right. Got the new look Knicks, which I had forgotten to make the trade, so <laughs> I had to actually make the trade for that. Um, Kevin Knox, I mean, I don't know. I might look into him again later, but I went with K to Bay D up. I watched him play, and he, I like the way he plays. He was a spur. Should be a good game. There is no better way to start off the new year than with the yeah. game of 2K Sports. With Greg Anthony and Brent Berry, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll be hearing from David Aldridge on the sideline. Here's a look at some of the stats for him. The most positive thing about yeah, apparently the created Tyler Kolek, Kolek was like hella OP, so I had to go in there and fix it. Because <laughs> like, dude, ain't really even playing. But from the draft class I had, he was an 86. I was like, yeah. Jalen Brunson and it's Robinson in at the center, filling out the middle, and for the Spurs. Green is out there with Murray. Then there's Oubre. And there's Jared Allen. The Catman. Catman dropped 44 already for New York. I still think they got missed Dante DiVincenzo, though. Josh Hart, it, man. He, I, but he ain't no Dante. Dante lost his damn mind last year. Anyway, let's get on. Fuck. Big ass. With it. Plus, I watched uh, the. Fires the three. Good, and as this goes to town. Calm down there. Really quick release there from um, Let that one go in a hurry. KBD was there when Dejounte was there, so. The screen on Brunson. Marie finds Uber. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Uncovered at the rim, finding cracks in the defense here. Early on. Oh no, you know really what? Smart basketball and exploiting yeah. whatever holes. I'm gonna put DeJounte right on Jalen. In the defensive squad. Oh, and he hawks it off the glass. Wow. Pass to Vassell. Shoots over Ananobi. And the pass to by Vassell. And such a solid player. Devin Vassell is someone you can really trust. Gives you a bit of everything out from that wing position. Brunson, no good. And so it's Oubre with it. He brings it up for the San Antonio Spurs. To keep rolling here following the win against Memphis. Yeah, in that game, the offense was firing. I put Garland shot on slow. Partly because the other team I don't know. was a no show. Yeah, it felt good in practice. Like that, I think so. they just stayed with a healthy, consistent pace to get Hell no! <laughs> oh, and here we go. Green's got it. The fast break chance. Oh, great ball movement there. First 130 gone here in the first quarter. Brunson against Murray. Brunson the pass to Robinson. A slam dunk by Robinson. Excellent court vision from Brunson as he's able to find the open man. So it's the Spurs now. Four point game. Right, you spent your first four seasons playing in New York. What's that like? When the Knicks are winning. Kevin, there is no place you'd rather be. The fans are incredibly smart, loyal, and they'll treat you like a king. But no doubt that media pressure is for real. I always wonder about those bigger guys, how much easier a read is like that, and Allen finds the open guy set up to shoot it. Outside, Towns. And there's the drive. That one doesn't drop. Excellent D there from Allen. Bridges with the steal. This is a Duan and open. Shot from the wing. Second chance effort. Towns, no luck. Yeah, better than giving up the layup. You want to go in there and use the hard foul. They Kelly had an off game. See if he can come back. Yeah. Good for two. Yeah, big 
part of this run here has been their ability to score from mid-range. Feeling really good about our team now. I think KBD is going to work out. Still need to sign like a backup center. She is not a center. And here's Green outside. Robinson pulls it in. He really suffocated him there, guys. Just excellent work. And the foul called on Jared Allen. That's his first foul. Devin had a great game last season. Last game, he was due for a good game. Here's Brunson, and again, it's New York. Sweet touch there from Brunson on the jumper, looking more and more dangerous offensively each season. Allen, a screen on Brunson. Murray kicks to Uber. And a miss there on the triple. Looking at the Knicks, they Still, took bro. the win in their last game against the Pacers. Brunson scanning the floor. And he gets the basket. Oh, Whistles shit. The whistle, so a chance at the line for okay. Bridges hey, Bro Brooklyn Bridges. I see you. Being able to finish through contact. Look at that. That was crazy. Shooting their first free throw tonight. That's impressive. What the fuck? What the fuck you doing, bro? What the fuck? <laughs> don't be on check in the full doing that. Man. I don't want him down the ball. Fuck it. Wide open. Hey. Still working on the dynamic of Murray and uh, Garland. This matchup with the Spurs, it's their first meeting of the season. A matchup that only happens twice a year. These interconference battles that are a lot of fun. Yeah, this one will be rotation is mostly good. Matchups are always pretty fascinating just because of timing on scouting and how often you watch teams like this affect some of the unpredictability of the East West battles. And here's Brunson after the three pointer from Kelly Ubra. Pass to Ananobi. The three. It's hauled in by DeJounte Murray. Spurs leading by four. Stolen by Robinson. And Robinson with a clear path to the basket. And it's sent back by Allen. That's a great shot. Jared Allen gets Fuck out of here. To escape his reach. Fuck with my pro. Pro block. Towns, the pass to Brunson. And the pass to Juan Anope. To the paint. It's stolen by Green. And here we go with Allen running it up the court. And Anope sends it back. Knocked away. Fuck. Jesus. Harlem Globetrotters. the show. Playing Memphis, he was nearly unstoppable. the wing green he's guarded by Ananobi and if they know what's good for them that's the way they'll defend against him every time he takes the ball on the three-point lane and the foul called on Jared Allen that's foul number two for him and now only one away from being in the penalty and it's the Knicks with the ball trailing by four pass to Bridges from the arc Good, and the assist goes to Robinson. Bridges got six. And that's a shot Bridges needs to just keep sinking. You can see his confidence growing. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And taking a quick look here, guys, at the hustle scores for the Spurs. I love the defensive concentration so far in this one. They're getting out on shooters and really doing a great job of disrupting the rhythm. They've done a great job tonight of getting out in transition. So that focus on fast break adds to your total in a hurry. The Knicks making a switch here. Nick Bride's checked in. Now here's Towns. Against Indiana, he was really on his game. Five to shoot. New York needs to get off a shot. That's tipped. You can see the coaching staff up there and clapping right now as Oubre on the defensive end getting it done. Allen kicks to Uber. Goes back up. 
Allen shows oh. up. New York wow, how'd I miss that? Here's McBride. Right side Robinson. Oubre, left side. And finished off by Oubre. You know, all selfless play right there from Green. He's all about getting it to the open man. New York's gone two or three from deep so far in this game. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Green. That is his first foul of the game. The Spurs making a switch here. Olenek's checked in. Then for the Knicks, Sims is checked in. And Hart subbed in for Ananobi. New York calls timeout. And as things present themselves throughout a game, teams have to adapt on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the just thoughts there, there's not many team. free not agent the centers playing, but the entire team Marks and he's checked in for Jalen Green and a chance now to see how teams are faring across the league. Here's the latest edition of the Power Rankings. Taking a look at New York, they're gaining on some of the teams above them, trying hard to crack into that top five. And San Antonio, they've proved the projections right. They are a dominant club, and they're going to be a tough out for anyone. Deep two from Clarkson. It's rebounded by New York. Towns has got rebound number five here tonight. You know, Greg, for the Olympics, basketball is a shared family passion. Yeah, I mean, Kelly's father was a coach, but his mom was actually the first woman to be an NBA scorekeeper. So he was raised around the game. And the basket by Vassell. Now, what a great option he gives them on every possession. And out of bounds as the Spurs yeah. in possession. Let's take a second to see the teams that have been the toughest inside this season so far. Number one, the Spurs. And anybody who's a fan of defense has got to love this team. I mean, no one loves to see their name on top of that leaderboard as much as this coaching staff. San Antonio making a switch here. Garland's checked in. Oubre can't get it to go. Definitely a situation to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. Here's Towns. He kicks it to Payne. Towns sets the pick for Payne. Campaign. Payne's on the trifecta. This is why Payne takes a good number of threes. He's pretty effective from there. Screen by Olenek. There's Garland. Banked in off the glass. And the Spurs lead by five. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Now here's Towns. His scoring totals are something to take note of. He's averaging over 19 points a game. And he drives in. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. And how about those long strides of Towns? He uses that length so well on these drives to attract contact. Brooks checked in for San Antonio. And a switcher also for New York. Jalen Brunson, he's checked in for Payne. Well, a great player on a great role at the charity stripe. The D has got to be careful. Oh, to shit. Too aggressive on oh. him him back for freebies. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy Just floating in midair. Look at Town's gum and then go by. <laughs> Look at that. Damn. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for the New York Knicks. It's a five-point game. Passes it to Sims. Towns for three. San Antonio with the rebound. Brooks outside. Ah, no good. Got hit. Looks like it. Pass to McBride. And again, it's the Knicks missing. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Brooks outside. There's the drive. Olenek inside. Sims there. And the shot goes in. Olenek can be a gifted scorer in this time. Working from the mid-range. Runs in the pass to Towns. And Towns throws it down. 
and credit the screen for giving him the space he needed to get to the rim. For sure, GA allows him to come in with the sledgehammer. Yeah, well, he settled for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that. And for those of you just tuning in, the second quarter of action is where we're at right now. And take a look at San Antonio's performance here. What do you think they've been doing or not doing? Well, look at the turnover ratio and look at the score. Easy to see what happened in that first period. Yeah, hopefully the opposition can recover because that first quarter defensively was unbelievable, just crippling defense. We've got Kelly Olenek. Brooks is out there with Evan Fournier. Then there's Jordan Clarkson, and it's Garland in at the one. That's the San Antonio five. Touch and control on the floater. Hart showing another element to his offensive game. Brunson against Garland. Clarkson outside. Brooks finds a limit. Back to Brooks. It's hauled in by Achua. Next trail by six. Brunson the pass to Sims. A shot's good on the assist by Brunson. Brunson's got five assists in the game. Just over one minute has passed here in the second quarter. Oh, shit! Garland attacking. Can't cash in from close range. Uh, for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. Down it goes. His third basket. He's now three for four. Well, Clarkson doesn't do huge assist numbers, but he won't waste a wide-open opportunity. And Jordan Clarkson is going to pick up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. And sports may be the ultimate meritocracy. Does it matter where you're from, uh, Greg, your background? Uh, you got to have game, right? Kevin, it's a beautiful thing. Some players grew up with a father in the NBA. Others were a world away. Either way, when you get here, you know you earn. The dunk by Achua. And not the prototype power forward, but he has tremendous athletic ability. Spurs leading by four. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldrich. What's the latest, David? Thank you, Kevin. New York City remains a basketball mecca. NYC legend and former Nick Mark Jackson always talks up the basketball environment. He says, coming up in New York, it's all about the grit, the grind, the edge, the competitiveness, the swag, the confidence, the struggle, and the embracing of the bright lights. Kevin? Well, it's all there, and it is the biggest stage for sure. David, thanks. And, and didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope, he, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. I, I don't mean style points. Well, these defenders had better start closing down on shooting. The pass to Achua. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. And Fournier kicks to Garland. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. Next trail by eight. Hart, wide open. He fires. Wasted no time on that shot, but it's off the mark. To the middle. And there's Garland. That's good on the assist by Brooks. Garland's got four points now in the quarter. Ah. New York's gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. Brunson against Garland. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That went on a limit. And we have really watched Jalen Brunson come into his own, playing at a higher level. Well, it's unbelievable, Greg, that he just had that spark here in Dallas and that that has triggered what it is we get from Jalen Brunson on a nightly basis. Respected for his toughness, his offensive game is growing. Here's what San Antonio is going with right now. Jared Allen's checked in for Kelly Olynyk, and it's Ajante Murray in for Garland. Brunson against Murray. There's the feeds of Bridges. And Ajante ah, Murray gets the whistle bitch. that time. 
That is his first foul of the game. I almost said that shit. In recent years, we've seen the rise of sports analytics conventions, pro basketball negotiation competitions. I mean, they're really digging deep. Well, they're not only digging deep, Kevin, but they're giving a tremendous opportunity to a swath of people that never thought they'd be part of the NBA. Look, if you're not six foot eight with a 35 inch vertical, that doesn't mean that you still don't have a place at the table in the NBA if you study hard enough or you can make contributions to what the business side of basketball is all about. Oubre passes to Allen. Almost, but it rolls out. Yeah, but the hand in the face. It's critical that you contest his shots every time down the floor. For three, Murray. It's rebounded by Towns. Towns has got six rebounds here tonight. In the corner, it's Robinson. Good Jared deep. Allen grabs the miss. Spurs leading by seven. Fournier passes to Allen. And it's Allen slamming it down. That's a great finish from J.A. High percentage look inside from a very high percentage shooter. And DeJounte Murray gets the whistle that time. That'll be his second foul of the game. And, and that's foul number two. And it, maybe you don't sit him at this point, but you really have to be careful to not pick up another before him. Green, he's checked in for Jordan Clarkson. Runs in the pass to Robinson. to Bridges. Six to shoot. There's the double team with Allen. Robinson for three. New York, no good that time either. There's some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's ah. equally good at guarding against him. And here's Brunson. He'll bring it up for the Knicks. They trail by nine points. After this game, they can look forward to L.A. Where they'll match up against the Clippers. And their road trip is only getting started as that's the second of six for them. And that's tough if you're the defense. Green just beating them with better O. Inside, here's Bridges. San Antonio with the rebound. Oubre has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Green. Again, the miss by Green. Knicks trail by 11. Pass to Brunson. Jacks up a three. Oubre pulls it in. Oubre's got eight rebounds ah. in this game. That's going to be over and back. Not watching for the line that time. San Antonio making a switch here. Harlan's checked in. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Nick Bride's checked in. So it's the Knicks now. Damn. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. Uh, first one falls for him. And getting to the line and hitting your free throws, a, a good way to get back into the game. It stops the clock and extends the game and allows you the opportunity to set your defense. They've been perfect blind so far here in the second quarter. Vassell, he's checked in for the Spurs. Here's Allen. That's good, and it's Garland with the assist. Garland's got three assists now in this one. The plan of attack is obvious. Get the ball inside and go strong to the rim. Here's McBride, guarded by Garland. And McBride gets it to go. How about that move? Is this guy special or what? Just love watching him operate inside. Pass to Allen. Excellent D that time from Robinson. On the wing, Bridges from downtown. Looks good, is good. Bucket number four from the field. He's taken only six shots. And he's on a good pace here from three-point range. Made one in the first, two more here in the second. It seems like... <laughs> Garland with the bucket. Garland's got six points in the quarter. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. McBride passes to Towns. Here's McBride. And it's sent back by Allen. Feeds to Green. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Mikhail Bridges picks one up. 
And once the G League took it to another level, Green skipped college, became the number two overall pick in the draft. And that's really changed the landscape. Josh Hart, he's checked in for the Knicks. Left side, Towns. Fires from deep. Oubre pulls it in. Oubre's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's Garland. The Knicks pull it in. They defeated Indiana in their last game. I thought they had a solid game plan coming into that one. And then they made good adjustments along the way. Well, the great thing about watching that game was that we saw it through their offense and they showed a few different looks. Oh, yes, sir. And one of Green's best assets, his leaping ability. He's a natural athlete. Very explosive. Knicks trail by 10. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Green. So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus. We'll go to the line to shoot two. The Knicks have made the most out of their opportunities at the line. They have yet to miss in seven attempts. And the Spurs with some changes. Kelly Olynyk comes in for Jared Allen. And Josh Richardson subbed in for Green. Yeah, I know this gets said a lot. Josh Hart plays with Hart. It's true, though. This guy is a fantastic competitor. Plays with energy on both ends. And it's infectious for his teammates. Bridges passes to Robinson. Up and in on the layup. Robinson's got four this quarter. Well, Robinson's staying with the shot. I, I feel there was definite contact on the play, so not easy to get that one to go down. Garland dishes to Oubre. All three off the mark. Not sure why he keeps trying his luck from deep here. It's just not his night. Robinson on the wing. The pass to on and open. Oh, good on the triple. Oubre finds Garland. Here he goes. Yep, that one goes in there. Garland's got the lead up to 11 now for San Antonio. Yeah, Garland did a nice job. Pretty lethal off the bounce and great body control on that drive. And so it's San Antonio holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They're shooting the ball so well in this one. A great performance from the field. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much. Tibbs going against a high-powered offense like this. I know you have your work cut out for you at the defensive end. Yeah, you know, they're tough to guard. They put a lot of pressure on you. You can't make body position mistakes. We've got to make sure we try to make them work for the points. We'll see if you can be more mm -hmm. effective in the second half. Thanks. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. And we'll be right back after halftime to start the mm -hmm. third quarter. See you in just a bit. Welcome, everybody. Let's jump right in with a look at the players of the week. And guys, I was just thinking, as I often do, in your travels around the league, the only team you both played for was the Orlando Magic. Did he play for them? Six games, and it was the worst six games of my life. Now let's talk about that first half. It's been a runaway success for the San Antonio Spurs. They're playing at a fast pace, seizing opportunities to beat the defense down the floor. That's created some mismatches that have been to their advantage. Running like a young Shaquille O'Neal. Well, I'm still running, Ernie. Running to the snack bar. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, that's though. And that'll do it for halftime. We send you back to Kevin Harlan, who has the second half call. Yeah, pretty close. Rebounds, assists. Welcome back. The calendar has flipped over, and so have we into the second half of our broadcast. We're seeing a tremendous game here, guys, from Darius Garland. Really impressed with the shot selection through the first half, just taking what he can get from the defense. Yeah, I'm thinking back to the first half and wondering, did he take a low percentage shot? Everything efficient. On the court for the Knicks, we've got Mikel Bridges. OG Ananobi is out there with Towns. Then it's Robinson, and it's Brunson in at the one. Kicks it to Towns. A three. Rebound San Antonio. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. 
You know, he's usually very reliable from out there, but tonight it's just not going down. Ananobi passes to Brunson. In transition, here comes San Antonio. Robinson against Richardson. 4-3, Oubre. It's rebounded by Ananobi. You talk about things at halftime, and then you come out and you go 0 for 3. I'm sure that wasn't up on the board. Bridges shot, good. And Bridges playing with extreme confidence is on fire right now. Spurs leading by nine. We know they like having Brunson out there, Greg. A player they can run the entire offense. Oh, that was huge! That's a big-time throw down, and Oubre can really fly. Brunson against Garland. Brunson kicks to Ananobi. To the inside. It's the flex. <laughs> Garland feeling it out a little bit. Olinick dishes to Garland. Olinick sets a screen for Garland. Barry's the long range jumper. Garland's got 15. Garland right now really doing a nice job of staying in perpetual motion. Brunson with a clean look. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Pass to Olinick. Garland out of bounds New York takes possession now let's go to the 2k leaderboard these teams have been training everything they put up this month the Spurs second and really the basketball IQ has just evolved just the way they move the ball and share it they always find good looks the Spurs making a switch here H. Diop's checked in. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Thank you, Kevin. You know, Jalen Brunson, for the NBA at least, is small in stature. But his tremendous footwork enables him to operate inside and out. He says, I've tried to make my game for what I had as versatile as possible. I've got to be crafty. I'm not jumping out of the gym. I'm not racing down the floor in two seconds. But I'm going to keep you off balance. Kevin? Oh, I love his game. David, I know you do as well. Hey, thank you. Outside, Towns. And there's the foul. It's on Keita Bates-Dia. That is his first foul of the game. Jared Allen's checked in for Kelly Olenek. Here's Towns. Sweet little floater. That's 10 points for Carl Anthony Towns. And I'll tell you, offense comes really easy to Big Cat. Green by Allen. Garland against Brunson. Here's Bates Diop. Off target with his three. Knicks trail by 12. And Anobi finds Bridges. And the foul called on Jared Allen. That's his third foul of the game. For a personal foul. Second team foul. On defense, the Spurs. Ananobi passes to Towns. New York moving the ball around. Lock at six. Here's Brunson. San Antonio with the rebound. Allen's got rebound number five here tonight. With him struggling tonight, they need to find some other options out there to keep themselves in the game. Here's Bates Diop. Robinson with the block. Such good instincts from Robinson there to throw that one away. Bridges misses. Yeah, and you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Here's Vassell. Once again off the mark by San Antonio. And here's Bridges. He'll bring it up for the Knicks. A 12-point game. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Mitchell Robinson is one of the best finishers that you have down low in the NBA. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Spurs. And they're playing beautiful basketball right now. Racking up the assists by playing so unselfishly. Just finding the open man. Well, another part of what they've done tonight is to get a lot of work done in the mid-range. And that's a shot that a lot of teams are willing to let you take. Well, they've knocked him down. Knicks trail by 13. Here's Brunson. Outside for Robinson. Outside, Towns. Good, and the assist goes to Robinson. Towns has got seven points for the quarter. 
It, it took a long time for him to get that first triple, but let's see now, though, if he can get going. And then Murray with the jam. Highlight material from DeJounte Murray ripping it down. Nice job capturing the moments on the AT&T 5G slam. Give it And stolen by Murray. Puts up a deep three. Ah. Pulls it in. Robinson's got nine rebounds now tonight. Murray against Brunson. And Fuck no. By Allen. And now running it up the court. Green pushing it all the way. Yes, that goes in. H. Diop's got the lead up to 14 now for the Spurs. New York's gone one of four in three-point shots here in the third. Brunson kicks to Hart. Back to Brunson. Passes it to Towns. Here's the teardrop. I'm trying, bro. By Allen. Uh, if he's going to keep shooting, they've got to run some plays for him. Screens, pick and rolls, anything they can do to get him started. Oh, not even thinking about it. When Green is catching and firing like that, you know he's feeling the hero ball ain't going to work, bro. That's too hard. And it's Vassell with the foul. That's foul number two for him. Second person of the foul. Here's Brunson. He's got seven, and that one drops. Nine points here for Jalen Brunson. Doesn't get much easier than that. Hart was licking his chops when he saw his man wide open. Murray for three. That's ah. rebounded by New York. Robinson's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And you can see he just didn't get squared up with his feet. And this will be his second and third shot to the line here. In their last contest, guys, he was unconscious from the foul line. Uh, Bridges is shooting a high percentage, and the game really does come naturally to him. Dylan Brooks, he's checked in for the Spurs. Richardson comes in for Green, and a switcher also for New York. Nick Bride's checked in. Here's Murray. He can't hit that time. Bridges with some nice defense. Well, his shooting has been a little bit below par. You think about what this lead would look like if he was on. And there's the pass to McBride. Oh, oh no, he's the last guy you want to put on the line. You can just about book the points every time he steps up there. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. And the second free throw, good. And here is Murray. He's got six. Tries the spin. Oh, shit. Robinson with the block. Man. His best quarter as far as scoring. Let, let's see if he can eventually get back on track. One on one here. Here's Allen. And it's Allen with the jam. I like seeing Josh Richardson distribute the ball, especially when his teammates are wide open. That makes for an easy pass. Pass to Towns. And here is Robinson. Shot clock at six. Here's Hart. That's in the short one. Almost Hart's had it. Got five. And Almost got that steal. On the three-point shot. Uh, they may want to rethink about stretching the defense a bit like they did in that first half. Well, the open man's out there. You got to feed him, and Murray gets the job done. Next trail by 14. Oh, fuck. Outside Went for the seal. Looking for Bridges. He gets it there. Bucket is good. 18 points for him. Maybe he's thinking at this point, man, somebody's got to help me. I can't do this all by myself. Brooks outside. Passes to Richardson. Allen a screen on Bridges. Murray right side. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Murray's got seven points for the quarter. I mean, he's shaking off that slow start, giving them a boost here in the second. That's too hard. Downs looking around, and again, it's New York. Could come down the selection. Bad shots in the first half. Here in the second, using his head, finding oh, some more efficient fuck. opportunities to score. 
Here's McBride. Plays it in off the breakaway. And there's that transition offense. Push the ball up the floor. The defense can't get set. And you can get some easy baskets here. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. For three, Murray. Ah. Pulls it in. Knicks trail by 11. Here's McBride. He has seven. Down low. Here's Bridges. And it's slammed in by Bridges. What a stuff there. Bridges doing it with authority. Deep two from Murray. From deep the quad. Count it. He got it. That's how you do it. Stay patient. Wait for the opportunity. And boom. That's exactly how you want to close out the quarter, too, with some confidence. And so it's San Antonio. Their lead at 11 points to end the quarter. They've set the tone. They love their tempo. They're going to be very tough to stop. We'll return shortly. And let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Well, there's a way to break down the defense with the handle. But you can do it with the pass. Prime example of that right there. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. DeJounte Murray is out there with Josh Richardson. Then there's Allen. Then it's Evan Fournier, and it's Bates Diop in at the power forward position. It's the San Antonio Five. Number 10, Darius Young. Murray against Brunson. Ah. Achua, the pass to Brunson. Back to Achua. That falls. Nice feed that time from Brunson. Murray got lost. <laughs> Brunson's got his seventh assist here tonight. To the middle. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. It's going to be on Precious Achua. Yeah, good job to take him right at the game. The first free throw is good. And so he makes both from the line. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for New York. They trail by 11. Releases. Garland with the rebound. Well, that mid-range J usually pretty much on the money. Maybe the timing just a little bit off on that one. Fournier best to Murray. Here's McBride. He kicks to Sims. Inside. Here's a chew up. And it's sent back by Allen. And here's Carlin for three. It's Allen on the wing. Carlin left side. Clock at four. Allen shot is off. Knicks trail by 11. It's Hart on the wing. To the paint. Here's a Chua. The dunk by a Chua. Man, he Damn. sure can get off the floor. He one of the best in the business, absolutely. The pass to Bates Dia. Takes the three. Once again off the mark by San Antonio. Not great numbers, but great effort in this one. Sounds funny, but I think he's been a positive for them. San Antonio calls timeout. San Antonio timeout. San Antonio going with an almost entirely new group here. Kelly Olenek checked in for Allen. Brooks comes in for Kata bates Dion. Vassell, he's checked in for Fournier. And Jalen Green subbed in for DeJounte Murray. Mikael Bridges checked in for the Knicks. And the short break in the action gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. During that break, Frank Vogel had some real words for his team. He told them, don't look at the scoreboard. We have to play like we're tied. They want their team to sustain what? that level of effort, and we'll see how it works out. Kevin? Thank you, David. 
For three, Bridges. That falls. Nice feed that time from Brunson. Brunson's a 6 0 run. Shit. Here tonight. Garland kicks to a win it. A sell against Hart. And he makes that one. And the Spurs lead by seven. And Olenek doing a nice job just keeping the symmetry out there. Goes up to the stripe. The shot's good from Brunson. And great intensity here down the stretch. He's not one to shrink in the moment. I'll take a look at him. Locked in right now in this moment. Wants the ball in his hands and feels real comfortable with the shot he's taking. And just about three minutes through the fourth quarter here, he can't get that one to fall. Well, he had one three-pointer in the first half, but so far in the second, he's come up with two eggs. Garland with the bucket. Well, Garland has some pretty good body control, even at 6-1. Good job of staying on balance that time. Runs in the pass to Bridges. Off target from outside. Well, the D really getting away with one move. Mm. No one on him. And that's going to be good nine out of ten times. And he just dangles from the bucket after sending that one through. And you can see which team has the swagger right now. In transition, here comes San Antonio. And he throws it down hard with one hand. And sometimes it looks like for Garland, the game comes a bit easy, whether making plays for himself or others. Now, Brunson. New York, no good that time either. Yeah, they had some boxed coverage that turned into no coverage. Next trail by 11. It's stolen by Green. And here's Carlin for three. Knocks down the three ball. Carlin's got 22 points. Uh, Carlin <clears throat> started the game at 6-1, but the way he's playing now, he's got to be feeling <laughs> seven feet tall. Hell yeah. Oh! Runs in the bounce pass. Can they get it? Here's Bridges. Hell no. No good there off the double clutch. Yeah, my expectations were that he was not going to miss that one. He handles that kind of defense, especially on the inside. Oh. And it's Green missing. Just a, enough coverage to bother that three-point attempt. Oh, damn. No San Antonio leading by 14. Outside Garland. And the jumper falls for him. Garland's got 12 points here in the second half. D has been just completely helpless and turned around. He's so dangerous when he's in this kind of rhythm. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. Jared Allen's checked in for the Spurs. DeJounte Murray comes in for Green. Robinson finds Towns. And the foul called on Jared Allen. That's his fourth foul of the contest. Fourth personal foul. Third team foul. Here's Brunson, finds the bottom of the bucket from 13 feet out. And that's 13 points here for Jalen Brunson. San Antonio calls timeout. And now we present our new balance player of the game, Darius Garland. And the way he's made his mark with his work inside, He's just been a slasher tonight. Always moving, getting to the basket at will, and just seemingly taking advantage of a D that was reluctant to get in his way. What a connection he has to these fans. Ah, come on. Love him here. And the more he has games like this, come on, the deeper babe. that connection gets. Here is Robinson. Ananobi with him. And Allen picks him up defensively. Bridges for three. Rebounded by the Spurs. Murray dishes to Garland. Brooks outside. Here's Vassell. 
And it's good. Assisting on the play was Brooks. And the Spurs lead by 19. Yeah, How they many times have we seen a crushed by this run? Like that from them today. Ending with the basket, coming off a pretty pass. Brooks against Bridges, and he makes good on the way. Brooks has got six here in this quarter. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Yeah, some of these nights you got to enjoy yourself. Not to the other team, but right now this team is balling. And even though he lacks the size of some of the other bigs, that extra effort has allowed him to do some serious work here on the board. And that's a strength of Mitchell Robinson's game, a force in the paint. Here's Murray, and it's Murray with the jam. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Yeah, no stopping him on that play. Sometimes even the taller defenders are helpless to stop him. Garland, two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And Garland does a good job there getting the shot up into the air. Free throw so slow. Out. Hey, Brent, in general, as we widen the lens here, what do you think current NBA teams could do better? Well, it's going to be interesting, Kevin, to see how with the defensive three-second rule sort of disappearing, how many more coaches are able to implement combinations of zone defenses? They're going to take away what it is that a team likes to do in the half court of their execution. Along with that, certainly clock management, Bang. maybe more usage of their actual roster going a little bit deeper during the regular season to explore those kind of tactics. And don't forget about all those experiments. They could happen in the G League as well. Brunson against Murray. Hell no. Murray. Well, Murray timing that one right. And with that 6'10 wingspan, he can get to it. And here's Carlin for three. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Robinson's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. Here's Murray. And it's Murray with the jam. And one team is just completely outclassing the other tonight. Spirited performance. And it really ignited what is turning out to be a monster win here for the Spurs. And this was one that never really was in doubt, I thought, an all-around dominant performance. And you kind of thought that maybe even going into the game. Yeah, there was a sense of that. And, man, they, they just pretty much blew them right out of the water. A clinic was put on display here today. And on the year, this will turn out to be win number 34 for them. And so they'll take the first game of the season series, a team they'll only see twice. They're certainly happy to start it off with a win. And one of the key components to this victory, if not the biggest, was the incredible performance for Darius Garland. He was tough to cover all game long. One of those nights when he felt like nobody could stop him, and they didn't. Well, at this point, they're just trying to get back in sync. You, you want to play a good brand of basketball. Consistency definitely is a, a key to some of the playoff performing teams, and tonight they just did not find it in this contest. Fourth personal foul. Fifth team foul. Shooting for New York. And that one falls for Robinson. Mitchell Robinson has really simplified his game. He's just focused on getting high percentage looks, being around the rim, both for offense and obviously Damn. shots and mature guys from scoring on the inside. He does those two things very well. Jordan Clarkson, he's checked in for Garland. Here's Vassell. Good. And this goes to Murray. Finishing strong. This is how you want to close things out. Yeah, definitely putting a stamp on this one. A very, very decisive victory for the club tonight. Yeah, that's a bad move there. Stops the clock and puts the other side on the line. That's good from Payne. The campaign has gotten this reputation, and it's well-earned as a professional. Just able to come in the game, ready when called upon. He's going to impact on both ends of the floor what's being done out there. And that effort level, that has kept him around. For three, Fournier can't connect. And so it's San Antonio easily taking this one. And the outcome of this one was never in doubt. And boy, they really put they in had a chance, sir. 
effort. I mean, it just felt like once they had they were on that six in a row right there, but then they were not going. Oh yeah, really steamrolled them. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. So for David Aldrich, Craig Anthony, Brent Barry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us as we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Darius Garland. If I haven't seen it. Eighteen and eight. Seven but oh my gosh, that's a career high. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Career high. Let's go, baby. Oh, G didn't do shit. I don't know what the hell. What that was there, bud. Got the win. Yeah. Yeah, two made threes. That's good. <laughs>